Welcome to the Nitrogen Cycle. Today we're going to learn how nitrogen moves around in nature and helps plants, animals, and even us. First, let's talk about nitrogen. Nitrogen is a gas that makes up about 78% of the air we breathe. But plants and animals can't use nitrogen directly from the air. They need it in a form that's easier for them to use, like nitrates. So, how does nitrogen change into something plants can use? That's where the nitrogen cycle comes in. Let's break it down into the different stages of this fascinating cycle. First stage, fixation. It all starts with nitrogen fixation. Certain bacteria, like Azotobacter and Clostridium, found in the soil, as well as symbiotic bacteria like Rhizobium, living on the roots of plants like beans, peas, and clover, take nitrogen from the air and change it into ammonia or nitrates. This process makes nitrogen available for plants. This is known as biological nitrogen fixation, and it contributes about 65 to 70% of nitrogen fixation globally. There's also atmospheric nitrogen fixation. During a thunderstorm, lightning provides the energy needed to break the strong bonds of nitrogen gas molecules. Nitrogen then combines with oxygen to form nitrogen oxides, which dissolve in rainwater and enter the soil as nitrates. This method accounts for roughly 10% of nitrogen fixation. Finally, there's industrial nitrogen fixation. Humans replicate this process by combining nitrogen gas from the air with hydrogen to create ammonia for fertilizers. These fertilizers add nitrogen compounds to the soil, boosting its fertility. Industrial fixation contributes around 25% of nitrogen fixation today, largely due to human activity. Second stage, absorption plants absorb nitrates from the soil through their roots. They use this nitrogen to grow and produce food. When animals eat these plants, they get the nitrogen they need as well. Third stage, decomposition. And after plants and animals die, tiny organisms like bacteria and fungi break down their bodies. This process releases nitrogen back into the soil as ammonia. Fourth stage, nitrification. Next, other bacteria in the soil convert the ammonia into nitrates, which plants can use again. This keeps the cycle going. Fifth stage, denitrification. Finally, some bacteria in the soil convert nitrates back into nitrogen gas, which is released into the air. This completes the cycle, and the nitrogen is ready to start all over again. 